three, two, one. Hey Beatitudes, Cammie here. We're back for segment two of our Strength and Balance. Uh, this segment, we're gonna change things up a little bit. Oh, this is a little loud. And we're gonna be in our chair with the band. So go ahead and have a seat and grab your band. All right. So I want you to come forward in your chair. We're gonna use our legs for resistance. So I want you to take one leg out, take that band around the middle of your shoe and cross it. Now, if you're a little bit forward in your chair and your spine is tall, I want that belly button pulled in. Now your palms are facing in towards each other. We're taking the elbows back, pinch the shoulder blades and release. Pull it back, release. Now, be cautious of how much tension this band can take. Here's eight, hold, release, pull. Seven, hold, release, pull. Six, hold, release, pull. Five, hold, release, pull. Four, hold, release, pull. Three, hold, release, pull. Two, Hold, release, one more, one, hold and release. Okay, we're gonna switch legs. So switch that, your leg is extended, that band is around your foot and it's crossed for safety, palms in, pull it back. It's back, hold, release, here we go. Eight, hold, release, squeeze that back. Seven, hold, release, pull. Six, hold, release, pull. Five, hold, release, pull. Four, hold, release, pull. Three, hold, release, pull. Two, hold, release, one more. One, hold, and release. Okay, here's what I want you to do, bend that knee. Now, I want you to hold one end of that band with your left hand. The outside band, and we're gonna adjust this. I want you to hold the outside band, outside of your foot with that right hand. Lay it right across your palm. Now this one is just keeping it from slipping. If it's short, that's okay, you can let it go. Your foot will catch up. Now, what we're gonna do is some bicep curl. So you're leaning forward, you've got your elbow on your thigh. We're gonna pull the band up and straight into a flat position. You're parallel to the floor, pull it up. It's up, hold and down, here we go. Four, hold and down. Three, hold, down. Pull, two, hold, down, one more. One, hold, and down. Don't go anywhere. We're gonna pick up the pace. It's up, and down, eight, and down, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're going back to that other foot. So put it under the foot, just like you were gonna do it with your seated back row. You can drop one side of it if you want to, and you can make any adjustments you need to. So pull it a little tighter if you want more resistance. Now you've got that band on the outside of your foot. It's laying right across your palm, and your elbow is on your thigh. Pull it up, hold, and down. Three more. Up hold and down, two more. Up, hold and down, one more. Up, hold and down, a little faster. Up and down, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, straighten up. 
Okay, take that band, kind of wipe it off in your pants there. We're gonna do a nice seated tall exercise. Thumb and forefinger right in the middle. Elbows out to the side. This is gonna help our posture. Back of the shoulders, close to the spine. We're pulling, pulling. Good, I want you to feel like you're wrapping those shoulder blades around the spine. Good, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh, shoulders and back, okay. So, we're actually gonna put the band down. We're gonna do some range of motion. Uh, some exercises that are just using body weight, so we're not gonna need any tools for this one. Now, you're forward in your chair. I want you to scooch back just a little bit, just right in the middle of your chair. I don't want you up against the back of it, and I don't want you where you're gonna fall out. Okay, so we're going to do some exercises where our body is gonna mimic a letter of the alphabet. So we're gonna start out with the letter Y. So I want your feet flat in front of you. What I want you to do is put your arms out at an angle, just like the letter Y. Your body forms the main part of that letter and your arms flare out like the top of the letter Y. Now from here, what I want you to do is lean forward so your belly touches your lap, okay? Now, look at your arms. Thumbs should be pointing to the ceiling. Do you see where this angle is? Good, okay, bring it down. Now we're staying right here with your belly touching your lap, pulling the thumbs up and bringing it down. Exhale, eight, hold and down. Lift seven, we're strengthening the back. Lift six, hold and down, lift five, hold, down, lift four, up at an angle, down, lift three, hold, down, here we go, two, hold, down, one more, one, hold and down, ooh, come on up. All right, checking that time there. Okay, our next letter exercise is gonna be the letter T. This one's easy. So we're gonna take a closed fist and we're just gonna take those arms right out to the side. Looks familiar, huh? Okay, so now we're mimicking a letter T. Now, once again, I want you to lean slightly forward so that your belly touches your lap. Now your knuckles are still up to the ceiling, right? Bring the arms down right by your calves. We're gonna lift them right to the same place. Bring it up. Hold and down. Exhale, eight, hold and down. Lift seven, hold and down. Lift six, hold and down. Lift five, hold and down. Lift four, hold and down. Lift three, hold and down. Lift two, hold and down. Down, one more like this. One, hold and down. Whew, come on up, okay. Oh, how do you feel? I want those arms right down by your side and you're going to roll those thumbs back and squeeze that back. Give me four of these. Four and release. Three and release. Two release one more one and release oh put your hands on your knees around your back Whew. all right i'm gonna send you off and gina's gonna finish you guys off with a nice little stretch and she will take care of stretching that back for you okay thanks for joining me tonight enjoy the rest of the show bye bye